how to use the new Facebook Creator app, all you need to know. Hi, I'm Lucy Griffiths, and I'm going to show you how to use the Facebook Creator app, which is brilliant if you're kind of a creator building lots of content. It's a way to manage all the messages, the emails from your business page so that everything is in one place and things don't get lost. I'm going to show you how to use it and the perks of using it, like being able to upload lots of videos. If you like this video, I would love you to subscribe. I share lots of tips and strategies to help you build and grow your online business. Um, and then also you can schedule your post. So I haven't got anything scheduled at the moment. Um, and it enables you to kind of keep on top of everything in a much better way. So I'm just going to upload um, a video in a moment. Um, and the great thing about uploading, I, I won't, won't do it straight away because it's quite noisy, but you can, you know, if you upload some content, um, you can do multiple uploads at one time, which obviously when you're using just the business page, you have to do one thing at a time. So I used to have like, if I was uploading a load of videos, I'd have 10 tabs open of my Facebook business page, which obviously is is not very <laughs> user friendly. So, um, you know, that's it's, it's just a much easier way of managing your content and seeing um, seeing what what else is going on with it so um this is kind of how you can see you can also with this you could add music if you wanted to and sound effects because obviously they um are very particular they'll mute the music so you could then add in the music um i'm not really into that but you could do it um and then we're back to pages so you can see um, my pages and um and what i you know, get up to there so you can get back to your your 
your Facebook business page very easily and manage that. Um, so it's, it's, you know, it's very user friendly and we'll go back to home so you can kind of see. Um, and you can also from here, you can go live. And so again, it's the same setting as if you were going live from your um, business page or, you know, very similar to your group. So, but there you can decide where you share it to. And, um, you know, so it becomes, um, you can then choose to, to, you know, share it in different places or whatever, and that can be really useful. And this way is obviously your, um, the persistent stream key, which um, enables you, which is there, which enables you to um, go live when you're um, wanting to use um, like software, um, external streaming software, which will enable prettier, better lives. Um, so that pretty much covers off um, how it works. Um, and you can also, by connecting to Instagram, if I connect to my account, and for some reason, it seems to disconnect and I don't quite know why that is because you know I'm connected and then I'm disconnected or whatever but actually then it enables you to um, you can manage your posts and comment on um, your Instagram messages or either the direct messages or the um, comments on um, your posts um, which is really useful um, and keeping track of everything. So it sort of enables you to store everything in one go. Okay, so that is the Creator Studio. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this useful and um, I would definitely suggest applying for this. Um, it is really worthwhile doing. When you go to your business page, um, you will, um, you'll be able to see, click on the Creator Studio and, and otherwise you'll see a big, tab along the top saying apply for Creator Studio and that's where you can um, actually sign up for it and, um, and then start using the Creator Studio. If you like this video, I would love you to subscribe. I share lots of tips and strategies to help you build and grow your online business. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, bye, bye.